living kidney donation, uh, as one of my patients put it, he said, this has become a lot less onerous over the last two decades. And that's in a large part due to the fact that uh, most of them are now done with laparoscopic or keyhole surgery. And I like the term keyhole because it describes the, the small cuts that we make. There are, some of them are half a centimeter, some of them are one centimeter. And uh, through those small openings, we can put these long, slender, fine instruments in and a, and a camera in, and we can do the same surgery, I think, better than we could in the, in the old days, as we call it, back when I was training. Uh, it used to require a, a foot-long incision, started in the back, worked its way to the front, you know, a big painful incision. People did what they had to do. But with this laparoscopic surgery, it's a lot less pain. Uh, patients are typically in hospital for a couple days after before they're good to go home. Um, a lot of people are able to go back to work in, in a few weeks. As surgeons, I can say we much prefer doing it the laparoscopic way. Uh, the, the optics are so much better. You see everything on multiple high definition screens. The instruments are very fine. You actually get way better exposure than we did with the really big cut that we used to have to make to, to take out a kidney. And uh, it's been said that um, uh, in the few years after the adoption of this keyhole surgery for living kidney donation, uh, that the rate of kidney donation went up by 30%. And again, I think it's like that patient said, it's just become a lot less onerous uh, than it used to be. To a surgeon, uh, the, the use of the keyhole surgery for living donation was, was huge. It was a very exciting time to be involved in, uh, in transplantation. Beyond that, the, the process for putting in a kidney to a surgeon it hasn't changed too much in 50 years, which is good. I mean, that tells me that they must have got it right. They had the right idea the, f the first time they did this. You know, I think um, the suture materials are getting better, the, the immunosuppression's getting better. Um, you know, the surgery, that part hasn't changed too much, but donation, what a, what a wonderful time to be involved in transplantation, to see that evolution, to, to see people be able to donate a kidney and be able to be home a couple days later. And in some cases, you know, some people, do not like to be in the hospital. They've gone home after a day. Um, amazing, uh, but did that harm them in it? I, I don't think so, you know? I think uh, uh, everybody responds differently to surgery. Everybody responds differently to, to pain. A lot of people have said, well, I've had surgery before. This is not anywhere close to the amount of pain that I had with that previous uh, surgery, whatever it might have been. So it's just, uh, just exciting to, to be a part of that, uh, that living donation through the keyhole surgery.